Alright traders, hope you guys did well today. Just a strange day. I mean, there were some really good opportunities today. Uh, just did not get filled. I mean, frustrating day for me. Really emotional right now. I had one trade. I mean, barely green. Did not trade it well at all. There were a few good opportunities today on the short side that I missed. Hope you guys nailed it and hope you guys enjoy the video. Alright traders, we got about a minute and a half until the market opens on up. You guys know what I'm watching. Watching a few stocks out of the gates here. AMTX, really looking at this one for a little pop to short sell. So we came out with some news, but this one is a pump and dump. If we look at the past chart history on it for the last few weeks, it'll get a pump in pre-market. Come on down, have a little spike, just like we see right here guys. We have a little spike at the open, and then start fading on off. Same thing back here. We have a spike, fade on off, pop, and then fade. Uh, so that's what I'm looking for today. I want to see a little pop, maybe 125, 130, and then we get our fade on. So I'm going to be watching AMTX for a short. EGAN, this one, getting really overextended, guys. At 1225 is the gap to fill. Very overextended on the RSI. We see that right here. Gapping up from around 750, now up to 1169. Would love to go for a short on this at 1225. Let's we'll see if we're going to get that little bit of a pump here on AMTX. Just no volume here on AMTX. Can't get the short that I wanted there. EGAN, please come up to 1225. I want a short on you. All right, EGAN's getting a little perky here. Uh, please go, please go, please go. 1208 order out on EGAN. I can't get filled on it, guys. I just cannot get filled on EGAN. Oh my god. Literally coming right up to the line I drew. This could be the first red day here. It's just so irritating. I had the best orders this morning on AMRS. I'll show you guys. Had an order right here at 543. Didn't get taken out. And that was the best order at the time too. And then on EGAN, uh, 1195, 1208. Just wasn't getting taken out on EGAN either. All right, let's get that pop on something. Can we get a pop on something? The discipline is real today, fellas. AMRS, this one's forming a bear flag right now. CVNA popping up on really, really strong volume right now. It came out with news at 10. All right, I'm going to go for that one at 33.71. Really small share size there. This one's really coming up to strong resistance, though. If we look at the chart, we got the 13 and the 50 day here, right around $35. So starting small, going to look to add. This is an emotional trade, guys. We're just getting a ton of hype right now with intraday news here at 10. So I'm going to be on the emotional side of this. Probably going to be red here just for a little bit. I just took it right there, guys, at like 5.58. I'm not happy at all with it. I'm probably a FOMO trade, honestly, because I'm really frustrated with the day. It's coming on down nicely there. That one, CBNA is coming down nicely. But, guys, i got to turn my attention to ADMA. i got shorts here as well. This one turned into the pump of the day. ADMA enters into 72.5 million loan facility with perceptive advisors. This is the pump of the day right here, but I'm kind of chasing it from 375 down to 340. Let's try to get a little bit of a pop on it. CVNA really coming down. So guys, I just took that off really quick. It was an emotional trade because because I was pretty red on it. And I meant to hide my PL, but I just completely turned into a deer in the headlights. Because uh, I hit it here, but then I forgot it was right here, so then I was just looking at it a lot instead of paying attention to the chart. Because if I was on this chart right here, I would have added as it started popping up. But nope, I didn't because I was staring at my PL. So CVNA, this would have been a big winner. Probably had I not been looking at my uh, profit loss. ADMA, if I would have been focused here, I had this drawn from a long time ago. This line right here, 375, that hit and just came right back down. Now it's under the 50-day as well. ADMA, I would love a pop on this. To take a short on it but i missed it it's just been one of those days guys uh but intensity works that's what i've been looking for it's just been a little slow today cvna that one on intensity worked great guys you're getting into the emotional side of it when it's popping up on the scanner uh, should have added to it but you see like on this guys as well adma the emotional side of the move when this is going up we got volume huge volume coming into it nothing but green candles that's when you want to start building a short position just like on cvna although i didn't add to it like i should have would have been a really nice winner if I would have added to that one. But I accidentally had the dollar amount here, which I was just staring at, and uh, I need to take that off. Absolutely take that off. I'm actually going to save this layout, not look at it anymore. Because I have noticed the last few days, like Friday and Monday, when I'm not looking at it, 
I'm really just in tune with the chart and trading the chart. But then when I see that number, I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't add because if I add, this could be a much bigger loser. You know, I'm just thinking about the dollar amount versus the chart. The chart is what I need to focus on. Uh, but guys, today is a very frustrating day. Please let me know how you did in the comment section if you did really well. That would make my day if some of you guys did very well. Also, really good news. Uh, the owner of Intensity Stock Watch, these scanners that I use every day, he wants to provide you guys with a great opportunity. This would make my day if you guys sign up for this. Now, I'm not getting any money for this. This is strictly for your benefit. Uh, it's $20 for two weeks. You can use these scanners. It's like a trial version. That's 2 bucks a day to use the data, guys. The data costs more than that. No one's making money off of it but you, so I'm really excited. Please take advantage of that. That's going to be a special link in the description just for you guys and traders. Let me know how you did. If you haven't yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We'll see you tomorrow.